Do you guys want to tell them what we're going to be for Halloween? Well, it is so good to be home. <laughs> Snuggling with my kiddos. I miss them. I missed you. <laughs> yeah. Okay, we need to go get ready. <laughs> I missed you. What did that say? On the cover, what did that say? Did that say there will be a monster at the end of this book? Yeah. Yeah? How are you, Isaac? Good. Mm. Our last one to wake up. I missed you. Yeah. We just got back from her doctor's appointment, and the verdict is she weighs 19 pounds, 8.8 .8 ounces. Is that more than before? It's more than before, so she gained some weight, but we still need to chunk her up. Let's give her some more bites of some pancakes and some bananas. Nana. Nana, you want some nana? Feed the girl. Lots of food for the girl. Toppins, toppins. <laughs> toppins, a banana for the girl. Did you get some cards? Janae is constantly wanting to play. What joy. You guys eating carrots? Yeah, normally a carrot would be like that big. Not Do you normally that. eat little carrot sticks? Do you know that carrots don't actually grow like the baby carrots that we normally eat? No. This is how carrots grow. And then they get chopped up into those little baby I carrots. I pulled my own carrot out. I remember that. We are busy running around and getting packed because we're leaving on our trip tomorrow, but there's one big thing that I've been meaning to get done that we need to make time for today, and that is to try on all the Halloween costumes to make sure they fit. Yay! <laughs> the kids didn't know we were gonna do this yet. Okay, do you guys wanna tell them what we're gonna be for Halloween? Yeah. Yeah. Ready, set, go. The Wizard of Oz! The Wizard of Oz! guessed that in the comments of our other video, so well done. It's such a good idea. Okay, let's hear who you're gonna be. I'm gonna be the cowardly lion. Tin man. Wicked witch of the west. Good witch. Glinda. I'm gonna be the scarecrow and say, Toto. <laughs> Can you say dog? Can you say doggy? Hmm. Oh. Oh, oh she's a got a dog in her hand. <laughs> she's like, that's my dog. Which leaves me as Dorothy, because I'll be carrying Toto. The Janae. So we're gonna try on the costumes. The only ones that I haven't purchased yet are Janae's Toto costume and Jeremy's Scarecrow costume. So we're gonna make sure everything else fits. I ordered it all online. I'm so grateful for online shopping. It makes my life so much easier. Oh, except for the shoes. I did buy the shoes in person. Here's your shoes. <laughs> What's this noise? Here's the tin man. You may need something to hold. Cowardly lion. Yeah. Go try on your wicked yes. witch. Whoa, that's awesome. Try on Glenda. Try on Glenda. Not my axe. Yes, there's your axe. <laughs> They're off. And my red ruby slippers. So in the book, the shoes are silver, but in the movie, they're ruby. And I decided, I was back and forth on which one I should get. I decided to go with ruby slippers just because I feel like it's more iconic. Oh, would you like to wear my shoes? Here you go. You wear mama's shoes. You have a hairy. tail. It's hairy. Yeah. Let me zip ya. Ah, somebody's running my tail! <laughs> oh, thanks. That actually helped. That dress <laughs> is adorable. <laughs> Maybe a little, a little big. big. It might be a we got the giant version. Size four to six. I think we just have a miniature head problem. This is why we try stuff on. So it goes over your foot. Come on out. <laughs> Are you serious? I love the hat. <laughs> Lisa has a hat. Do you like it? Oh, yes, you're having the same problem Isaac did. You're gonna have shoes on, and that will work a little bit better. Those ruby slippers. <laughs> My pretty. She's getting into character. <laughs> we got a way to tighten this. Duct tape. I think I can attach Velcro. I mean, for four to six, they're not yeah. really close. Right? Like, I don't know if it's... It's bigger than your head, so... Sometimes costumes, part of it is just figuring out how they go on. I'm so happy you still have your crown on. <laughs> Gotta get the job done. Okay, what do you think? <laughs> Uh-oh. 
Wait, when did we decide we'd give a costume <laughs> with an axe for Caleb? Luckily, it's plastic. <laughs> I think it works. We just need some makeup. Where is that lion? You lion! <laughs> <laughs> it looks like it needs a little uh, yeah. primping, maybe. Yeah. Kind of reminds me of the, where the wild things are, you know? There's ears in there somewhere. You look good. You do. It fits like perfectly. I buy it, unless you're too scared. What are you doing? Hello, Dorothy. The ruby shoes. Hello. Now all you need is to have your hair down and your hair in ponytail. So little like this with some bows, mm -hmm. some ribbons. What do you think? You like my shoes? Yeah. Shoes? I don't know if you're supposed to do this or not, but I'm trying to like fluff it in just the right ways. And It's hard because they're all packaged in like these tiny little packages for months. I'm hoping that getting everything out and hanging it up Maybe ironing some of it will make some of the costumes perk up a bit. I think once the kids have the makeup on, that's going to be a game changer. So Aunt Michelle is amazing, and she volunteered to take all four kids over to her house this afternoon for a play date. My niece Allie is in a play, and she's going to take them all to go see that play tonight, and Jeremy has so much work to get caught up on, and we're leaving tomorrow, and I've got loads of packing to do, so it's a really big help. Yesterday, my friend Martha said, Fancy pet store. Where did you get yours? Look how big Clifford is. He had a big Janae dog. has been so fussy Clifford? and yeah. she's so into this. Well, she said, when I was little, I lived in the city. Mm. So this is a Marco Polo or a video of my dad and he's reading a book to the grandkids. So I turned it on my phone for Janae and she is just eating it up. I love it. And his dog had had puppies. It especially helps that the book that he's reading to the kids is about puppies. So she's in love with it. She's like a baby bird. Mmm, smoothie. So I got a yummy smoothie. And she wants it, but if she drinks out of here, it's gonna get all gross. I'm trying a lentil quinoa chicken bowl. Janae's having mac and cheese. <laughs> Caught you. It's good. So Janae shares his food, and apparently he likes taste testing her food too. No shame. Janae found a little spot to sit in. This is her little perch over here. Yes, I know we shouldn't just put her in a high chair, but she hates it. Queen Janae on her throne. To be honest, she's a charger. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's so fun to be here with her um, without all the other kids just because we so rarely get that one-on-one -on -one time. She brings so much joy to everybody that goes by though. Everybody says hi, and she says hi. 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 Yeah, them. Those are friends. Dad, dad, you know. We need some more warm clothes, and I totally tricked Jeremy into coming shopping with me. Yeah, that little baby doesn't have a head. But... I need that. Yeah, let's leave the headless dolls alone. Just taking them off. Apparently she wants some new shoes. Oh, you like those ones. These. These? These. Got to teach them when they're young that they don't get everything they want. These shoes are just fine. Can I get us out? Janae keeps telling this dog no. No! There's this room right here that's just full of paper airplanes. 